These slides introduce the purchases and payments process from Chapter 6 in the textbook. Again, we're going to use our Sunset Graphics continuing example. But first of all, let's look at the standard accounting for purchases and payments. In this example, on October 1st, we purchased inventory for $1,495.50. We recorded a corresponding accounts payable for $1,495.50. The terms were 210 net 30. So on October 11th, we take advantage of the prompt payment discount. We reduce accounts payable by debiting accounts payable for $1,495.50. We record purchase discounts for $29.91 and we credit cash for $1,465.59. Now for Sunset Graphics. Their purchases process involves first researching prices and checking for product availability. Then they select the vendor with the best prices and availability combination and send a purchase order to that vendor. They then receive the items from the vendor and record the purchase and accounts payable. And finally they pay the vendor according to the credit terms. Here's a simple BPMN activity model of Sunset Graphics purchases and payments process. First, after the start, they request prices and availability. They place the purchase order. They receive the items and correspondingly record the purchase. They then send payment to the supplier and that's the end of their process. Let's look at an alternative. Now we have a collaboration model of the purchases process where the supplier and Sunset Graphics are shown in two pools but none of the activities in the pools are modeled. We're focusing on the message flow between pools. In this case, Sunset first requests prices and availability. The supplier responds by providing prices and availability. Sunset places the purchase order. The supplier sends the items and Sunset pays the supplier. Finally, we'll look at another alternative. Now we have three functions within Sunset. The supplier is in a separate pool, but none of the supplier's activities are modeled. So the message flows connect to the outside edge of the supplier pool. First, Sunset starts placing the order to the supplier. We receive the items from the supplier. We assess the items. If they are not okay, we send them back to the supplier and a process. If they are okay, we're going to place them in inventory. Then we're going to wait 30 days and the accounts payable clerk will pay the supplier. And that's the end of the process.